Want to enjoy Pyrex at a sensible price? Guys, Anton's back again with another review, and today I'm showing you the Smoke Tech Pyrex Mini. There she is. It is a cardamizer tank. Now this is running at uh, 1.5 ohms, and I currently have it on the Proveri running at 3.7 volts. So if you haven't got a VV mod device or you're on an Ego, you know this is how it's going to be. Yeah, straight off the bat, a great tasting cardamizer. Really, really nice, okay? So let me just take that off real quick and explain what it is. Okay, so once again, it is the Smoke Tech Pyrex Mini. Okay, now the main difference that this has over the original, it is it is a two mil capacity tank rather than the original's four mil capacity tank. Now, um, you gotta watch out, like on uh, vendor sites and manufacturers, they'll actually advertise this as a four mil tank or, or four mil capacity. Uh, that's not actually the case. Uh, what they're actually talking about is the cardamizer will hold about 1.5 mil, uh, then the tank about two. So they sort of add those figures up to get 3.5 or, or four mil. So the tank itself is actually a two mil capacity tank. Okay. Now, the other difference that this has over the original, it actually comes with a different um, resistance cardamizer. This actually comes with a low resistance 1.5 ohm single coil um, cardamizer. So it's actually far better. It, the cardamizer this comes with is far better than the original. The original uh, Pyrex came with a 2.5 ohm cardamizer and I actually mentioned in the original video to discard that one straight away because it was weak. It's not the case with this one. This one actually comes with a, a, a very good smoke tech um, cardamizer and it's good heat and, and very clean tasting. So that's great. Now, obvious, uh, and another thing they have um, supposedly done is upgrade the glass. Now, you know, it's, it's hard to tell at the moment while it's still together. But supposedly, they I have read that they've upgraded the glass. Um, I'm not sure if that means it's thicker or just a better quality. So I'll be doing a drop test very shortly and uh, be sure to check that out. Now, I, you know, just like the original video that I made, I actually recommend this Pyrex tank over the Kenga Pro Tank, uh, even the Pro Tank 2. The reason being is Smoke Tech played it smart and they, they put an aluminium sheave over the glass, okay? And if you watch my original drop test between the two, uh, even though the original Smoke Tech Pyrex tank had thinner glass, it far, far out, um, you know, it had much more strength and durability than the Pro Tank. Actually, in the end, I had to get a hammer and smash this. That's how strong it was. So it'll be interesting to see if they've even further improved the glass and made it even stronger. I'll be sure to have my hammer out again. <laughs> So, um, so that's what it is, guys. It's basically, um, you know, uh, very similar to the original other than it just comes with a different uh, cardamizer and supposedly the, the glass is um, upgraded. Now, these will set you back about $13 or $12, okay? Just the, the original is actually the same price also, $12 or $13, and the mini is $12 or $13, okay? So, um, you know, they're almost half the price of the Pro Tanks. They're a lot stronger, and they're much... What, what the real selling point for these are is they're so much more versatile uh, than the Pro Tanks. Um, the Pro Tanks is a bottom coil, will always stay as a bottom coil. You know, you can't really change anything. In, you can't change the internals. Uh, whereas this, you can buy any branded extra large pre-punch, pre-slotted cardamizer and put it up in here and enjoy it. So whatever vape you're happy at, you can actually put inside here and it will work fine. So, you know, to me, that's the real selling point uh, as, uh, um, as well as sort of half the price as well as the durability of it. Okay. So to me, it's a no brainer. If you want to experience Pyrex, this is the way to go. Okay. All right, guys, um, I'll just, ooh, I'll turn this up to 4.2 and we'll give it a vape. Okay. And once again, this is running at 1.5 ohms. Wow. Yeah, I'd recommend if you buy this tank, just start it at 4.2. Um, it is absolutely fantastic. It, it soaks up the juice, no problem, even if you blitz it.
absolutely fantastic. No dryness to it, no burntness at all. It is absolutely um, just fantastic. If you want to exp experience Pyrex, this is the way to go. All right, guys, I'll check you next time. See you.